can't play nothing. It ain't, it ain't gonna happen. That's the waste of the lure. Yeah, that's the waste of the lure. Like, we, I, like, I actually know what I'm gonna do in the next hour. I'm gonna try to throw a monkey wrench in your shit every time. We're on the most high schedule. Is that going? What do you want to go into? We're gonna talk about that shit. I got some trips to get. You got anything you wanted to get? Whatever. Uh, John 16 and 2. Yeah, Bible. Oh, that's a good scripture. I think we get Matthew uh, 10. <laughs> Matthew 10 chapter. That's a good scripture. 16 so, or you can start at the top and you can get Matthew 10 these things Matthews no yeah, you never say Matthews well I told him I, I got, got to confused man John, John 16 I'm gonna start at the top these things have I spoken unto you that ye should not be offended oh yeah because most people when they hear so we out here teaching the Bible we out here to wake up the lost sheep of Israel who was scattered among all nations and we telling people all the words of the Bible. And people, they always got a problem with these words of this, this Bible. They hate this book. Like, people always want to say, how come y'all, the only thing you say is those words that's in that book. Why, why you let a book run your life? Well, that's because this is the book. That's why. This is a, this is a magnificent book. It's a, it's a bad book right here. You show me another book that can compete with this book. Got a, this this has the most powerful words ever written. That's why people hate the words that's in this book. They got a serious problem with it. They want to kill you. People will want to kill you, actually murder you for teaching this book. You know what I'm saying? That's how powerful these words are. Because these words is cut up your spirit like a two-edged sword. They chop you up into pieces. They may make you feel like a pile of shit. They make you feel like the piece of shit that you are. Okay? Yeah, I want you to get a uh, hold on deck. Let me read this precept real quick before I go back to that John. This is Isaiah 34 and 16. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord and read. No one of these shall fail. Right. None. This is the book of the Lord. Whether you assholes want to believe it or not, these are the actual words of the Most High. There's no other book that even compares. Okay, keep going. None shall want her mate. For my mouth it had commanded, and his spirit it had gathered them. Back to John 16 and 2. They shall put you out of the synagogues. Yea, the time cometh that whosoever killeth you will think that he doeth the most high service. Right, because we always got people making death threats say they're going to kill us. <laughs> like we'll debate with people and we'll prove them wrong and we'll make them feel so stupid and we'll fuck their spirit up so bad they will actually want to kill us just like the apostles uh, Great Millstone there's a video on YouTube where the, uh, the, the apostles of Great Millstone they were debating with this Egyptologist guy his name was Polite and they disproved him so many times and debunked his false teachings so many times it made him feel so stupid and fucked his ass up in his spirit so bad, he went and got some bloods and some crips and said, now we're going to kill you. Mm. He's like, since I can't beat you in a, a knowledge of wits, a battle of wits, and a battle of knowledge, now we're just going to shoot you. He's like, the hell with the knowledge and the books and facts, the hell with facts and truth. I'm, we're just going to shoot you. We're just going to kill you. That'll shut your ass up. And people think they can shut us up by killing us. But like we say, I say on the way up here, it's like when you watch Star Wars and the motherfucking Darth Vader kill Obi-Wan Kenobi, his ass got more powerful after death. You know, so that's a parable. You know what I'm saying? Because we, 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 we more, it's like the Hydra. You cut one head off, 20 heads are going to take its place. Ain't no stopping this, man. You can kill us. Uh... I'm gonna keep going. Is there more to that? Um, Ain't no stopping this, man. And these things 
will they do unto you because they have not known the Father nor me. Right, because people want to kill us. That's because they're evil. And they don't believe in the Most High. They don't believe in nothing spiritual. They don't believe in truth. But these things, yeah, this, I guess. Yeah, more. But these things have I told you that when the time shall come, ye may remember that I told you of them. And these things I said not unto you at the beginning, because I was with you. But now I go my way to him that sent me, and none of you asketh me whither goest thou. Right, he's telling that he's about to get crucified. Yeah, because they killed, they hated the Lord so much. The one y'all call Jesus. He, cur he was cursing people out so bad with the scriptures and people hated him so much that they put his ass on a cross, crucified him, drove nails through his hands and put a spear through his side and put a crown of thorns on his head. Hey, get that scripture I told you to get. Yeah, start at 14, we're gonna read all of it. Matthew 10, verse 14. Whosoever shall not receive you, nor, nor hear your words, when you depart out of that house or city, shake off the dust of your feet. Keep going. Really, I say unto you, it shall be more tolerable for the, the land of Sodom and Gomorrah in the day of judgment than for that city. Yeah, so that's going to be more tolerable for Sodom and Gomorrah. The Sodom and Gomorrah was a, 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 a city full of faggots and freaks and adulterers. And the Most High destroyed that shit by fire. So what you think he's gonna do to America? Keep going. Behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Yeah, we're sheep. Uh, Sheeps are harmless. Keep going. But ye therefore, be the, sorry, be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Yeah, we wise as serpents, harmless as doves. Y'all, you don't even know nothing about that. Keep going. Uh, but beware of men. For they will deliver you up to, to the councils and they will scourge you in the synagogues. Right, that's going to like, you get on YouTube or anytime we talking to these fools, everybody want to talk shit about us, say we're evil. So, you know what I'm saying? Like that dude we was just talking to down at Wendy's, that pre that bootlegged preacher. Yeah, the wolf with sheep's yeah, he a wolf, he's a wolf in sheep's clothing. You know what I mean? People think they are righteous and shit. Keep going. They, they, Don't know shit. They look at this like y'all some bums, or like your boy Polite said. What you? <laughs> he said our we got bed bugs on our garments. <laughs> they said we got bed bugs and shit. They make fun of us. Say we look like we got our garments out the trash can. We look like we homeless. You know, what I mean? they people just talking shit, man. <laughs> Keep going. Yeah. Hey, this whole world is a trash can. You want to say I got my garment out of trash can? This whole goddamn country is a trash can. Keep going. Verse 18. And he shall be brought before governors and kings for my sake, for a testimony against them uh, and the Gentiles. Yeah, motherfuckers are... People, we had it happen many times. That we'll read the uh, scriptures to people, and then they'll call the cops on us for it. That's some bugged out shit. You read a scripture, they call the cops on you. What kind of sense does that make? Keep going. So they want to kill you, they call the cops on you. They doing whatever they can to get you the hell out, out, of, out of their presence. Okay, because the people, they have a serious problem with this Bible, man. Keep going. When they deliver you up, take no thought how or what ye shall speak. Right, keep going. For it shall be given you in the, in the same hour what ye shall speak. Keep going. For it is not you, for it is not ye that speak, but the spirit of your father which speaketh in you. <laughs> right, so it's not even us speaking. It's the spirit of the heavenly father speaking through us. Yep. He created us, our, his spirit is in us. Right. Keep going. And and the brother shall drip the blood, sorry. The brother shall deliver you up. Yeah, and people the, who claim that your brother the same people, oh, we, we all brothers. We all, we all brothers. It, man, shit, your goddamn brother. That's the same motherfucker that stabbed you in your back. You know, and I'm. And let me give reference to my own biological brothers. They ain't my brothers, because they don't behave. They act like my brother. Yeah, the only brother is the person who's doing his work. Shit, my brothers will stab you in the fucking back, man. 
Literally. Look, well, here comes your homie. <laughs> yeah, here comes oh, hell no. Keep going. We gotta get this out before he starts talking. No, just a good one, Charles. Uh, and the brother shall deliver up the brother to death, and the father with the child, and the children shall raise up and against their parents, and choose cause them to put to, be put to death. And you Walk by be, real fast. Hey, I'll get back. <laughs> get him on camera real quick. Uh, it's too late. And he tried to sneak past it. <laughs> What's up, libtards? Nation of devils. Whole bunch of goddamn devils. Goddamn losers. They. Devils. L7, devils, L7s. A whole bunch of goddamn devils. <laughs> all right, my fault, keep going, bro. Matthew 10, verse 22. And ye shall be hated of all men for my name's sake. Uh, we, 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 we shall be hated by all men. Why are you guys out there calling snakes? Excuse me? Why are you out there calling snakes? What, what do we call you? Libtard. Are you a libtard? Yes, sir. <laughs> he said yes. I'm a liberal, yeah. But if, how about can I call you a name, but you actually just said yes, you are a libtard. Well, because I know what that connotation means, that I'm an idiot. <laughs> well, that's, liberals are people. idiots, though. Okay, to your opinion. You agreed, you said you mm -hmm. are a libtard. Because I know what you meant by libtard. <laughs> <laughs> libtards are very offensive. They, you offend me. I'm sorry to feel that way. You do it, you're offensive. Because you're a racist. Actually, you disappoint us if you didn't call us. Yeah, that. right. Why would I call us? You disappoint us. I don't know. So, do you believe in the Bible? That's not a Bible. Let's, oh, it's let's, that's, that's let's awesome. It's strictly between human beings. Human beings. What, what is a human being? What does the word human mean? No, my man. What does human mean? What does the word human mean? I'm flesh and bone. No, we ask you what human means. What is, what is, what what is what, human mean? What is the etymological root of the word human? It's I am a creature. Well, I mean, what, what do you do? You, you know what an etymology how, means? How, how high is it? It's like the sun. You guys are Well, you live to are supposed to be geniuses. Dude. Uh, and you, you are on Reddit all day? I'm not saying we are. You guys are kind of out like, you guys do your thing, man. It's America. You do your thing. What does that mean? It's America. America. <laughs> You're free. Free to what? For you guys to stand here and say for you to be a faggot, to commit adultery, to worship Satan. Mm. Okay, yeah. you guys are fucking crazy. Did, where sure is the church? Where America, you serve as America. Where is the church of state Satan formed? Do you think it's okay? Do you believe that people should have the religious freedom to worship Satan? Do you believe in freedom? Let me pose that back to you. Do you no, believe no, in that, no, no. What is the word freedom? I believe in liberty, not freedom. Okay. Those are two different words. So you think that you should go exercise your religious philosophy? What does the word liberty mean? No, 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 no. Let me ask you this. No, you no, no, you call yourself a liberal. No, this is key. What does the word liberal mean? You guys think you have the right to come out here and tell everyone how to live their lives, but we can't tell you how we want to live our lives. But you want to kill my children. Authority and you want to. But you want to kill my children. Authority. You want to murder my babies. So do you think it's okay for a woman to have an abortion? Who gave you your moral righteousness? And I know you're going to say you're God. Prove to me that you're... You guys are out here fucking with people, man. That's what you're... <laughs> We're right? trolling, motherfucker. Yes, and you... How effective is this? It's very effective. How, you think that you have any fucking efficacy among any of these people right here? You think anyone's going to stop and be like... We don't oh, care about everybody. You actually Then think, why are you here? We're not a numbers game. <laughs> why are you here to make yourself feel better? To fuck with you. <laughs> That's the whole point. That's the whole point. That's the whole point. Now let me ask you a question. What does the word liberal mean? You said you're a liberal. What what is liberty? There is not a. What does it single... mean? Dude, what? You're, you're asking questions. To answer. I, I, I need to. No, no, no. You're not going to treat me like an asshole. If you want to sit here and talk Give me to the definition, the etymology. I'm going to tell you what I am. There is not a label. You cannot consolidate and you cannot compartmentalize political ideologies. They all crisscross the same stuff. I believe in that we should have the authority to. Authority? We should have the ability. Okay, hold on. You're going to question what I just said, the word authority, but yet you're out here telling But we are the here. authority. We're the authors. Who are you, dude? Who do you believe? <laughs> we, have, we, are, we are the authority. No, 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 no. Let me ask you. Who we we speak with authority. Who, who do you think you are? We are the, the prophets. No, 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 no. The no. What, what group? We are Israelites. We, are, we have no religion. No, don't, dude. I have no religion. He's, asked, he's religion. answering your question. Where, 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 where do you congregate? Where this do you meet? Right what, here. And what do you call yourself? We're Israelites. We're Israelites. Hebrew Israelites. 
12 tribes of Israel. We're, we're, a nation, we're a nation of people. God's chosen people. And you study the New Testament, the Old Testament? I'm not, I'm not touching that. The, 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 you might burst into a ball of flames. I'm showing you what we read. I, guys, I'm trying to have a civil conversation. Who do you, who do you worship? But you are solely looking at antagonists. You eat the fruit, don't you? I'm an atheist. You, oh, you're an atheist? Growled. That means you're a So when you call yourself an atheist, I do not believe in God, mythical being, because it's a social construct of one's human psyche. You pray for an authority figure to base the legitimation of your own beliefs to society. You guys can do what you want to do, man. That's so right. you, I'm not you, you, you're wrong. So you believe there's no there's such thing as right or wrong, then? That's just all yes, made up, right? Yes, dude. There's a sense of intrinsic morality. Yes, there is. I no, but atheist. where does that come from? I don't go out murdering people. I don't go murdering people. I'm a Why not? Person. Why not? There's no, it doesn't exist. Because we have a social con a, a social construct. You have a civil society. We know there are social norms that you abide to. Do not social say norms that that, established do by whom? Do not say social that. Social norms based. established How by whom? How many people have died in the name of holy war, in the name of their God? That's good, because the Lord is a man of war. Do you believe in the Ten Commandments? Of course. What the, about the, thou shalt not kill? There's, was, no, there's it's, ambiguity. No, no, no. It, it there's really ambiguity says, in, that. in Hebrew, there's two, two different words for murder and kill. It says thou shalt not murder, actually, in the Hebrew. You guys think it's okay to kill the science. So you don't know the Ten Commandments. You don't know the Ten Commandments, are. I was raised in the church. I know. What church was you raised in? Was you molested? No, <laughs> what the fuck, man? Because a lot of these churches molest people. Who and that's you? wrong, dude. That's wrong. What church were you born in? Why is it wrong, in? though? If you don't believe in God, you don't believe in the laws of the Bible, listen, why is it wrong? Listen. You should be able to... I'm trying to be nice. Do you believe it's okay to, for a woman to have sex with a horse? No. Why not? It's a social norm. Established by who? Society, dude. Our laws and regulations, everything around yeah, well, the it's ancient not, it is not derived the from the The ancient Egyptians had sex it with animals. Not, then they're ancient. That's, there's a reason why it's ancient then. It happened in the ancient But there's a pyramid on the you back of a dog. You have few outliers in every society that go against the norms, dude. Whatever. So you're pretty you much, guys, you so you're pretty much telling me you that you believe in biblical law. You you tell me you believe you in biblical law. You, you guys are conflating. Super is a bear food. I, no, I, and, I, and I wish I had something. You guys are conflating you morality a few, a few. with your Bible. No, they, you can have. That, that they're is, not mutually exclusive, man. You, yes, guys are, are. you guys are probably. They are exclusive. I might not go to where you guys think you're going to go when this life is over. That's fine. I'll accept that, man. That's a choice that's a choice that's 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 but there's nothing wrong with that because I mean, a few, because the Bible says you're not supposed to do it, so you agree with the Bible. Yeah, it's it, it was a book written by man from the prophet or whoever you think it was. They heard his voice. They didn't hear his voice. No, whatever. hey, get, get an Exodus the 20th chapter. We're not no, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna show you something. So, do you believe? Have you ever seen a UFO before? No, I. So, well, hopefully one day you might get abducted by a UFO. Dropped off in the middle of the woods. I could. Nah, dropped off in the middle of the city butt naked. Yeah, in the middle of the city butt naked <laughs> with a probe up your ass. That couldn't happen. That couldn't happen. That couldn't happen. What would you better read? Fuck. Oh, okay. I'm going to ask a question for you. Psalm 63, verse 1. The fool has said in his heart, there is no God. The fool has said in his heart, there is no God. God. But you've been brainwashed. You was raised in, was in a country. I did my own. Independent research where? Yes, when I study and I see the travesties that are going on in this world, and when I... Who controls the world? When I look and I see what happens in this world, and when I think about just the moral concept, just the intellectual concept of there being some being out there who wants us to obey his commands. He's a loving God, but if you disobey him, you're fucked. 
that's not a love that, I, we never, that when do we ever say he's a loving God? I'm going off the New Old Testament. He is a loving you, God. You're going off what some faggot little Christian told you. Because he's in the Old Testament. Stop with the personal facts. But there are all these Christians in these churches are a bunch of faggots. Yes. yes. Oh, what does the word know? faggot mean? A bundle of sticks there to get are. burned up. That's what they're going to get that's burned up. That's what faggot means. Fag. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. There are homosexuals, yeah, whatever. Who, that, who gives a fuck? But you guys are out Did you know? Let me ask you a question. Did you're you out know? You're looking to mess with me. No, did you know, according to the CDC, the homosexual have a higher rate of STDs Ooh. and HIV than any other demographic? That's that's just not you like and you if, believe in science, if, right? If I, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, that's because they because they tend to be rectal sex. And they they the rectal ass rape each other. More susceptible to tears and so you so, right so the same thing. That's a threat. No, it you're not supposed sex. to have sex. With, no, same thing. Who, the, 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 says who? The says average who, person says who, says does who, not go inside someone's asshole. Guys, where are you guys basing? Science. science. No, 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 no. Science. I believe in the science. The way, oh, guys, I'm trying to be nice. Man. You're being. Do you believe in science? Yes or yay or nay? I'm asking. No, I hold what it. book that you guys read? Where do you think that came from? Do you, you, you think that is divine? Yes. It that, came from. That the, is the word of your superior being. The Lord. No, I yes. know this. Okay, that's fine. That's and, fine. and it's not just my superior being. The Most High created all things. Someone told you this, did they not? Yeah, the Most High told you. No, 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 no. You went to somebody and they told you this is the truth. What about no. everybody? Stop and think for a second. Please, so I have like two, yes. two, two minutes to talk. Go Please ahead, bro. Uninterrupted. Go Please. ahead. Because I know you guys probably watch this hard. I'm enjoying this. Go I've ahead. met guys like you. That's cool, whatever. That's, so you've never met no one like us, bro. I'm not from the city, so I don't know. Now you've been deceived. Like, I you know you guys are kind of You don't think a phone of us is cool. <laughs> Yeah, he ain't never met nobody like us. That's fine. And That's all. Right. You guys, no part two. No, the listeners. Okay. All right. I got this thing of homosexuality. Go here, man. What is that CDC? I'm assuming you did that book was not true. You did not fall asleep and wake up and that book was in your lap. One uh, of actually, you guys came in. You guys <laughs> came in. What's the best book of came, all time? You guys came in contact with somebody who already had that book in their possession. Well, my they then told you our exactly. And they I told, what did I just tell you? That this was the sense of authority. But, but this was listen legitimate. though. I told you it's that we are in It's tradition. Exactly. You guys are the tradition of who? You guys are trying to perpetuate your own it's rules. Rules. It's man -made. Whose tradition? It's starting with you and you're passing it no, to it's, it's not man made. Let me ask Let you me this. Ask you Let me ask you. No, 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 dude. Yeah, you, you if just your ask word yourself. is so divine, if your word is so divine and so pure and so truthful, why the fuck is it not reached out to? Why are you the minority? Because there's a. But if God, the minority if God is, is a small number. Power, you're, you're, you're the Lord so said, you're "Many God, are called, your God but is few, autonomous, few uh, are omniscient, chosen. omnipotent. Your God is all those things. Yes, Why is He failing to spread what you guys believe?" Is the Listen, truth? the Lord Why said, "Many, failing? many are called, but few are chosen." That's why, a famous why scripture. Why would he do that? Then why would he already... Okay, by your own admission, he just said that a lot of people aren't going to listen to you guys. Exactly. Now, let me ask you this. We are fools for Christ's sake. Let me ask sakes. you this, dude. If that's what he wants, if he says right off the rip, guys, there's going to be a lot of people don't agree with exactly. you. Exactly. Why he then made those people, he knew they were going to be like that. Yes. Why would he set them up for failure? Because... If he wants them to succeed, if he wants them to follow his way, why would he make a predisposition for them to doubt him? Because... Come on, man, and you're going to rely on the faith argument. I know you're going to... You're going to say it is a, it is a test of moral say. solidarity, it is a test of moral integrity, and it's your mission that was embarked on you guys to go spread the word. It the is Lord a man said it social construction you guys religion. That's what you're doing. You're hurting yourselves, you're hurting society, you're hurting the people hurt around myself. you. You are hurt because man, yes. we are all the, we are all the same kind. We're brothers. No, we're not. Yes oh, we no. are dude. No they can take you in the lab. We're Me and you are the same fucking person. Yes we are. We're made so. of the same yeah, we have the same fucking <laughs> no, DNA. No. We're the same person. Your mind is what's different, that you is lost it. Your mind. You, Yo, you guys have lost your minds. You like, Fucking look around <laughs> you, man. Look around you. Like this brother. is the only life you're going to have to live. And you guys are trying to fucking divide the society. Yes, like brother. Brother. The, the Lord Shame can't. on you guys for trying to we fucking are like We are not brothers. Yes, least, you are. Even you are trying to fucking yes. tear apart the society. And shame on you. This society is already torn apart. Shame on you for not trying to This society is already torn apart. Wisdom and solidarity. 
Shame on you. That is so fucking incendiary. I'm, I'm, I'm done with this. You guys don't run, man. Don't run, man. I let you talk. Don't run, man. I let you talk. Nobody threatening you with nothing, man. We let you menstruate all over the place for like right. five minutes. Now, right. look, let us say I something. I can't believe you guys think you're religious and you're flying up. We're not religious, religious man. We're, We're not religious. religious. You believe in a God, a religion. No, you're no, religious. No. What does religion mean? What do you mean? believe in? What religion, do you believe religion, 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 Are you spiritual? There you, are you, there you go. Okay, so this you're is a, a spiritual thing. Dude, well, what is spiritual this is a mean? spiritual thing. Have you ever? You inspired? follow a God. <laughs> but yes. what is a, what, there, you believe God. in something? There's you believe God. in a? You believe in one set? Because you clearly only have one fucking playbook. You guys go by. Well, you, you believe in one set? No, fuck that, man. You guys believe in one fucking thing. And you're out here trying to fucking tear apart the hunter, but you don't know what we, we know believe. You won't let me fucking talk. Uh, because you're telling me what you fuck. You're reading it to me, dude. You're telling me you that never fucking homosexuals. I and God willing, I never fucking will. Have you were shut the you fuck are, up you for are a second? Saying, fuck you. Fuck. Hey, look, no, look, come on, man. Just like a goddamn coward, man. Yeah, goddamn. The wicked flee, but no man pursue. Fuck you. <laughs> Whatever you say, douchebag. <laughs> Get that butt plug out! Yeah. <laughs> Fucking faggot. Hey, he's going, he won't, I let him talk, he won't shut up. Hey, read that, what are you about to read? Fucking creepy ass eat of mine, man. We fucked this spirit creepy up. Creepy ass yeah, cracker. He's, he's, yeah, he's messed up. He need to get his picture about peace. He's a total mess. Right I right. thought we supposed to love everybody, but he said, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you, right. That's right. how, we was just talking about that. Oh, just a goddamn eat of mine, Yeah, man. yeah, that was definitely Esau. saw. Goddamn eat of mine. That wasn't no Israelite. Not even a, we're if that was an Israelite, most high got a lot of teaching for me. Take a run and I was about to get some of that Malachi from that. Oh, I did with something to shut up. Oh, up. I need that umbrella. It's raining. Yeah, I got an umbrella. Brother shit. Brother shit. Brother, shit. brother this, brother that. If we brothers, how come he said fuck you? I thought we was brothers. Goddamn oh, motherfucker took off running. Did not Cain slew his brother Abel? <laughs> That motherfucker will kill us if you had the opportunity, man. I'm having problems. Yeah, that bitch got a beautiful ass. Oh, man. She got hips and everything. She got a shape. You might as well read that, man. You might as well, even though the clown gone. Yeah, read it anyway. Then we're going to get back on track what we was talking about. And vibration about. is still chasing his ass. Well, he, <laughs> he might come back. Yeah, he's fucked here, he's fucked up. He might have to clear up his, his conscience yeah. and come back and get even get the thing first. He gonna, he's thinking, he is thinking. Mm -hmm. I'll go ahead and read that. That umbrella doesn't even, it's terrible. Luke 12, away. Luke 12 verse 51. Away. Suppose ye that I come to get peace on earth, I that, tell you. He said we was dividing everybody. Keep going. <laughs> I tell you, hey, we're rather division. Right. Damn right we out here causing division. <laughs> the fuck do we think we supposed to do? Yeah, I we supposed to bring people. everybody together? Right, right. Who the fuck wanna come together with him? Yeah. Who wants to hang out yeah. with him? Yeah. We're gonna go hang out with him. We're going what are we gonna do together? Right. He probably wanna start playing with you. Mm -hmm. Start filling on you and yeah, shit. Watching gay porn yeah, watching shit. some gay porn and doing all kind of weird shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he had a foul, foul, foul spirit. A very foul spirit. You know? And he, yes, he, that's, he got mad because we called him a libtard. That's what he are. I said, are you a libtard? He said, yeah. <laughs> Fucking libtard. And he said it himself. He said, yeah. And they don't know the word liberal. I kept asking what the word liberal means. Lib liberal's a Latin word. You ever, you ever see a, how do you write the word pounds? LBS. Pounds. L, you know, you say something weighs 25 pounds. When you write it down, you write 25 pounds. LBS. Right, that's right. That LBS go back to the Latin, uh, liberus, is where you get the word liberal. Because to, to be liberal, to have liberty means a, a balanced scales. It means the weights are balanced. That is dealing with weight, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Because the Lord, What's that scripture in Proverbs? Uh, he said, uh, unbalanced scale is an abomination to the Lord, or something like that. You know what right, I'm saying. Right, right, right. You know what that is? If you know where it is, bring it out. I can't remember where it is on top of my head. I used to have it memorized. Hey, but you know, he even knows some scriptures, don't he? Uh. <laughs> yeah, unjust balance, or something like that. 
Go ahead, bring that up. False balance. Bound yeah, false balance. That's it. Yeah, I know something like that. Proverbs 11 verse 1. A false balance is abomination to the Lord. Yeah, a false balance is an abomination to the Lord. So when you have a false balance, that means there's no liberty, because liberty means balance. So your boy was not actually a liberal. He was just a faggot, fool, and a fool, and a bitch, and a devil. Goddamn Edomite. So there wasn't nothing balanced about that motherfucker. He was off balance. He had one weight way up here, the other one's way down here. <laughs> That's it. That's funny though. And broken, he got broken scales. That's just like that lady of liberty. The bitch got blindfolds on her with the scales. That's what that goes back to. That's why she's called Lady Liberty and she's got the scales. Yeah, yeah with the blindfolds. Yeah. yeah. Can we get back to what we were going Yeah, get back to that Matthews. Uh, Matthews 10 and uh, you still have that? Yeah, get back there to Matthews. Like you said, Mr. <laughs> yeah, he was mistreating all over the place. Right, right. And then took off running just like a bitch. And I let him talk because usually, you know, that was three years ago. I would have cursed his ass out at the top of my lung. I just let him talk. I just knew he was going to run. But he wouldn't shut up and let us talk. Like, just shut the fuck up, bro. Trying to read the scripture. And they hate it when you come out this book, man. They, they hate this book. Why does everybody hate this book so much? <laughs> Remember he said it causes so much war. <laughs> That's a good one. You're damn right it causes war. That's what it's supposed to do. It's going to cause another one. It's going to cause another one. <laughs> the last one. <laughs> That's the beauty of it. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, yeah. You see, you got Christians who would deny that. Oh, that's not the truth. That's because yeah, they'll try to explain. No, that is the truth. This does cause wars. I got to read that. Uh, where was you at? I forget. Yeah, that's good. Read that. Matthew 10, verse 22. And ye shall be hated if all men for my name's sake. Right, that dude hates us. What guy we was just talking to, he hates us. You know why he hates us? Because we're coming out this book. Because we're teaching about the Lord. He actually said, he said, he said, Fuck you, motherfuckers! He cursed us. He, I mean, that, that was that was came from the bottom of his soul. You know, he really meant it. He really hates us. He really meant it. That was a good time too. I was, I, I was mad he left. I was having fun. I know, man. That's my fault, man. I just keep going. <laughs> But he that endureth to the end shall be saved. So he that endure to the end, and you keep teaching his word. You can't let motherfuckers face you. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. right, right. Even if people say they're going to shoot you, even if you got gangbangers saying they're going to kill you, now you just keep teaching the word and curse these fools out, man, with no fear. Because it can't be. Even if they physically come out here. Even if they physically come out here, you just keep reading the script. And you know, ain't nothing to get faint-hearted about. What, they going to kill you? Right. Ain't nothing to get faint-hearted faint about. Right. And you well, see, they bleed too. You see what happened to the brother Stephen in the book of Acts? Oh, man. And he said he cursed his motherfuckers out so bad that they stoned him to death on oh, the spot. Man. He's like, shut the fuck up and just started launching stones yeah, at him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he, he cursed him out to the very last breath. That's right. And Stephen's back out here again. So if you start shooting at us, why I don't got one or two bullets in me, I'm still going to be cursing at you. Cursing your ass out. You know just what I mean? Like, just like Maccabees when the brothers was on, put on the, the skillet, they cut his limbs off. Yep. He, he was he, still cursing them still out. Still cursing their asses out. That's right. You're going to have to cut my goddamn tongue out to shut me up. Bring it on. Bring it on. And then you cut my tongue out. I, rah, 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 mother, rah, rah. I still curse your ass out with no tongue. I tell you, I use my last breath to come find a chunk out of these motherfuckers, man. Fuck these people, yep. man. Fuck these people, man. You got more of that? Yeah, there's more. There's way more. Okay. 23. But when they persecute you in this, in this city, flee ye into another. For verily I say unto you, ye shall have, ye shall not have gone over the cities of Israel to the Son of Man be come. The disciple is not above his master, nor the servant above his Lord. Right, the disciple ain't above. What happened to the Lord? He got crucified. What do you think it happened to us? Keep going. It is enough for the disciple that he, he be as his master, 
for their servant as his lord. If they have called the master of the house, but see, but see, but see, but see, my science is fucked up. How much more shall they call them of this household? Of this household? Fear them not, therefore, for there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed and hid that shall not be known. What I tell you in the darkness, that speak ye in light. Yeah, so we ain't keep no secrets. You know what I'm saying? We let everything be known. Keep going. Right. And what ye hear in the air, that preach ye upon the house tops. That's what I'm the house tops. That's talking about we out here. Keep going. And fear, and fear not them which kill the body. Oh, right, this is the point. Listen good. Read that again. And kill not them. With, and I'm fear sorry. not them. And fear not them which kill the body. But are rather, they fear not them will kill the body, but are not able to kill the soul. That's right. For, but rather fear him which is able to destroy both soul and body in hell. That's the most high. That's the most high. So, so yeah, so you ain't supposed to just, just because somebody can put you to death, big deal. Big deal. So you know, it's like that polite guy went and got some bloods and crypts. Saying they gonna kill that, kill the apostles of Great Millstone. You know what I'm saying? Big deal. What you gonna kill somebody's? Uh, you gonna kill someone's flesh? Like you, like that killed their spirits. And you, you making matters worse for yourself when you do that. You know what I'm saying? So you can't. You, it ain't a goddamn thing these people can do to us. You can kill off, kill us off. Kill our physical body. But you ain't getting rid of us. We ain't gone. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Think they got some kind of power because they can kill a person. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? That we, 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 we are going to die any damn way. Think you actually doing something. <laughs> That's a joke, man. It's a fucking joke. So you ain't supposed to fear none of these motherfuckers. No gangbangers. No, you ain't supposed to be afraid of the police. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Cause you got a lot of people they won't teach the Bible because they're afraid to get arrested. They're scared to death of the cops. You know what I'm saying? Fuck the police, man. We curse the goddamn cops out. Fuck the police. Fuck these gangbangers. Fuck all you. Fuck all you two third pieces of shit, man. Fuck these goddamn devils. Your whole chapter is fired. Cause really, Matthew 10 is really the like you do say. This is our playbook, mm -hmm. but this is the playbook to win Super Super Bowls. You know what I'm saying? This the one Bill Belichick was having his, his cameras pointed at you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. this this is spiritual. You can't you can't spy on this and cheat. It's like that playbook <laughs> off. Uh, what was that? You seen that movie Waterboy? Your dude was always trying yeah. to steal the playbook for right. the crazy for the funds or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> the water boy. Yeah, this is a good play for it. Yeah, this is a good play. This got all the plays in it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's why you can't nobody fuck with this, man. That's why we can't we we don't we don't ever get confounded. <laughs> right. we, we, that's why we be clowning on people, man. We we trolled this shit out of that motherfucker that came up here. <laughs> he got trolled, you know what I'm saying? He got clowned on. Right. He this thought he was gonna come up here and talk that shit. Like he was gonna convert us, prove us wrong or something. <laughs> that dude's a joke, man. That worldly knowledge you came with. Hey, you see how stupid he looked? We gonna watch it, watch the video and laugh at his ass. He came with that old school Atari uh, football with that limited amount of plays that you can choose. Oh, he on Tecmo Bowl got four plays. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. We got his shit figured out. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go. He, he got, got the same, same goddamn plays. Same shit over and over. Make sure it's starting to rain out. What is that, hailing? Okay. Is it snowing out this motherfucker? Are you going to stop? I just keep going until it, it's the whole chapter's fire. Verse 29. We're going to get uh, the end of John 2, the crucifixion. They say it got no king to see. I'm going to get that out. Are not two sparrows sold for a, for a father, and one of them uh, shall not fall? on the ground without your father. Yeah. But the very hairs on your head are all numbered. Fear ye, there, be, fear ye not, therefore, ye are more valued than many sparrows. Mm -hmm. Whosoever 
Whosoever therefore shall confess me before men. Oh, uh, this is key. Read that. Whosoever therefore shall confess me before men, him will I confess also before my Father which is in heaven. All right. How do you confess your house shot before men? By doing the work. We come out here on the streets teaching. That's what it's all about. You got to confess the name of the Lord. What's it? You know the Lord's name? I bet you don't know the Lord's name. Come here, man. Come here. <coughs> What's up, homie? Nothing much. Well, you know, what's up, you guys? Teaching the Bible. You believe in the Bible? Uh, I believe that there is a Bible. There is a Bible. Right there. <laughs> right, there's many Bibles. You know, the Bible is the best selling book of all time. Yeah, I've heard. It's the most powerful words ever written. Who wrote them? Huh? Who wrote them? The, the men of them. The men of the Lord wrote the Bible. The apostles, the prophets, Moses, Zechariah. The, the Bible tells you he wrote it. The book of Zechariah was written by Zechariah. The book of Matthew was written by Matthew. The book of Thomas, that's not in the Bible. Yeah, it is. It's not that Bible. Well, the Bible just means book. But the book of Thomas is essentially, says the same thing as Matthew. Yes, it does. What, tell me what's different about it. Thomas is a parable. That are uh, similar, there's like definitely some overlap, but it's not the same. Anyway, I see, I see like, you know, a lot of good, good stuff in that Bible, you know, a lot of wisdom to pass on, you know, it's like... Let me ask you, so you, so you know what this, you know what this says, according to the Book of Thomas. So let me ask you a question. I don't know everything about the Book of Thomas. Who, who did the Lord come to say he came to save? Which Lord? The one they call Jesus. Jesus Lord? When they say call Jesus Christ. But yeah. No. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Who did he come God? He was saved man, right? No. Mankind? No. No. That's not true. No, I failed the test. <laughs> he came to save Israel. Israel. The Israelites. That's right, the chosen people. Exactly. I have. You guys ever seen that picture of the earth from the moon? Right. Yeah? Well, it's a painting. Moon. That's a painting. From the movies. It's a painting. That's a painting. You ever really? seen it? It's, you know, they got satellites going over the Earth, right? And they're yeah. so far out, right? Yeah. Those satellites took sections. They can't take a whole picture of the whole Earth because they can't, the, the camera don't spread out that wide. They're just in, like a puzzle put together. Sure. Those well, cameras took pictures. What are you pictures. talking about? You're talking about the one from the space shuttle. Well, there's, with, with the, uh, end of the there's like the Paul Lander. Right? One of them so is a like, painting. There's a Paul yeah, right, Lander, right, which is right, like right. The, the Earth like rising on the moon. They're famous. They're famous. Yeah, yeah. That's a painting. No, nah, that's real, man. That's, that's not real. That's not real. That's not real. So what about the one with um, the Saturn uh, Explorer? You right. know, the one that sent past Saturn that turned back? There ain't nothing that went past picture. Saturn. What? There ain't nothing that went out to the moon. They can't go past you, the moon. Why not? They can't even go out to the moon. Wait, wait, they they, never they, even they, been. They've never been to how, the moon. How do you know that, though? You saw, let me show you something. You ever heard of what they call the, uh, the, the Van Allen radiation belt? It's called a Van, Van Allen radiation Van belt. belt. It's what their radiation is a series of three radiation. Actually, there's four now because they discovered a fourth one. Yeah. A, a series of radiation belts that's going around the Earth that protects the Earth. Oh yeah, from uh, radiation, solar radiation. Yeah, radiation yeah, yeah, yeah. belts. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Because that's what causes the aurora borealis when those ions hit that the streams of the North Pole and are ejected causes beautiful light. <laughs> yeah. Northern light. Yeah, northern light. That's what that is. Yeah. All right, so go on. So what about the radiation okay. belt? But the radiation is coming in. It's too thick and powerful. It's too, it's too intense for anything man-made to even make it about through that. What do you mean, like, like thick? Okay, what happens when they send those robots into, uh, what's they call it? Um, Fukushima. Fu 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 Fukushima. Yeah. Hey, well, let me use Russia's for an example. Um, uh, what's it called? Chernobyl. 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 Okay, they send out their, whatever they call their drones. They immediately, after like 20 minutes, they started malfunctioning. Well, that's yeah. from the radiation. That's a different type of radiation, right? That's like radiation decay from uranium, which is definitely different than ions from the sun. <laughs> you, you know what? Different. What year did was the moon landing? I don't know. What was that? Uh, was it 1968 or 69? Well, you, the ironic part about the moon landing, right, is these rockets that we designed to get up there. <laughs> Who designed? 
well, scientists in Germany and the United German States scientists. were told, yeah, unfortunately, right? Because the, the secondary use of those rockets were not just the good kind of humanitarian, let's go to the moon and explore. Unfortunately, you, they use those rockets also to launch nuclear warheads. Right. That is like the most dangerous part of that program that came out of it, right? But yeah, I, what I'm still, saying though is uh, yeah, yeah, the moon landing happened the same year the 2001 Space Odyssey came out. The moon landing was directed by the same person that directed the Space Odyssey. It was directed sure, by sure Stanley Stanley Cooper. Yeah, they, sure the, did the, space the, the government hired Stanley Cooper to do the moon landing. All you have to do is go back and watch the videos. You can see it's all a, it's a, uh, it's, 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 it's a, all it is is like a movie. Uh -huh. It's a short movie, like a. Plus, they can mini series that come on thirty minutes. And they even That's show if you watch the moon landing, they show you there's supposed to be so much less gravity on the moon. Mm -hmm. yeah, there's a many examples. One small example is they showed the moon rover on the moon in a different incident yeah. when they had the rovers up there. Yeah. And the way the the dust was kicking up off the tire was exactly the same way the dust kicks up the tire on planet Earth. Sure, I mean like the... But there's supposed to be less gravity so the dust would go up and start floating away. Right, and check it out. When yes. it came down, yeah. look at the photos. Don't let us tell you this. Look at the photos. There's no blast crater. Yeah. From the, when it was coming down, it has to have a, 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 a blast coming up out the ship, right? To slow it down to land it, right? For a me, blast crater that's hitting the Earth, hitting the moon. For look me, at the picture. For me, the biggest proof is that... Uh, <laughs> That so-called, that, that pod they landed on the moon with, it looked like it was made out of aluminum foil. So we put <laughs> It looked like something off a, a 50 science fiction movie, like a okay. Lost in Space or something. Now, don't let us tell you this. Yeah, yeah. Now, look at this video. It's on YouTube. It's yeah, called yeah. A Funny Thing Happened on the Way to the Moon. That's, that's the a video. Real, it's a famous documentary. It's all, I got it on my tablet. Yeah. You can watch well, it on my tablet right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen a lot of this stuff, and like there's things, certain things that interest me, like thinking about more, like for example, like things our government might not be doing without telling us, right. like uh, a lot of stuff. A lot of, a lot of, of stuff. That's like for example, of one of the big things that I'm particularly worried about is um, the chemicals we spray out of planes that change the weather patterns. Like that. Yeah, chemtrails. Exactly. Now that's a legitimate every, thing. Every day you see it. You know, the average person. However, if, you, if you tell them yeah, yeah. to watch the chemtrails and watch it form into a cloud, yeah. people will say you're crazy. Yeah. We'll even, even though you can, you can watch it. You can watch them spray. But here's the deal. Some of them are contrails and some of them are chemtrails. Well, you, so you, you gotta be you can watch be it, discerning. Though. You know, but you, you can discern. watch them form in the clouds though. Sure. You know what I mean? Now here's the deal though, with the space program, oh, right? Space. Like I've been yeah. pretty discerning about that. The science makes sense, it adds up. Like we are more than capable of doing that. Oh no, no, not going to the Oh moon. for sure, man. They yeah, surely yeah, haven't gone to gone Mars either. Right. Uh, all the footage from right. Mars was filmed down in the Atacama Desert down in South America. It's all to keep the people thinking that this man's got Magical powers, yeah. you know? When the magical What's powers magical is deceiving all, right? people and thinking they did it. That's the only magic they have. But deceiving people thinking they did it. They and can, people eat it up. They, can, it they up. can go out in space. That's what you would call space. They because you can go out really, really, really far. Yeah, like uh was it how large is space? How, well, how put big, it this way. How big is our universe? Well, I wonder. Well, the oh, it's, 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 it's infinite. Infinite, yeah. Most right? high is infinite. Right. Yeah, well so that's the thing. But yeah, put I, it this way, let me yeah. break it down to you like this. A Russian cosmonaut was up in outer space or as far as he could go because they can't only go so far mm -hmm. which is still pretty far yeah right but he right. said the russian cosmonauts were inside of a, their space shuttle they looked out the window they said they seen a giant celestial being with a human face with wings It'll pop right up. Oh, yeah, well, there's another one you was Russian. talking about. Yeah, that's the one. The one I'm talking about is when the Russian actually said it was an actual black man. Do you, do you believe in the UFOs? I believe that there's probably extraterrestrial life, but I don't know. But it, like, you know, sometimes we have like a lot of crop circles. I don't necessarily believe that that was created by extraterrestrial life. I think a lot of people, like right. farmers, yeah. are kind of looking to get some press, the right? Crop, they want to get, yeah. Yeah, they yeah. want to get some attention, so yeah. they do that. They, they prove people to do that. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's the idea. And another cool thing about the pyramids, right? You guys like heard about those? I, for a while, I thought maybe that that was something that we we couldn't explain. So people were saying it's aliens. Pyramids here on Earth? On Earth? Yeah, yeah. Egypt. Okay. Yeah, in Egypt, right? And so it turns out 
uh, Mexico. There's like these, there's these hieroglyphics of them pouring water in in the hieroglyphics right. in front of the people dragging it. Right. And we were thinking at first when we saw that, oh, it's a ceremonial. Water is always used for ceremonial right. things in the desert. Then we actually did some experiments where we tried pouring water on sand. And if you pour like the right amount, like not too much, where it gets all like boggy, but where it starts like to, not not so much energy, but right. it keeps the sand sticking together a little bit. You know how like sand right. kind of sticks together in place. So instead of the sand kind of like bring up that friction, which makes those blocks way too heavy to pull, by keeping that sand stuck together a little bit, just a little bit of water, yeah. it makes that friction lower, and you can pull the big bricks. So before, when we were thinking, oh, there's no way man could have built these pyramids, you add that water into the equation to make the friction reduced, now the pyramids can be built by the number of people that were there. But they were built by people. Yeah, exactly. Right. A lot of people they think were that was, by, built by the Israelites. Oh, but a lot of people think they were built by aliens. Oh, yeah, yeah right? that's so then. But they had giants helping too, though. And a Naki. <laughs> well, so here's the thing. Here's, this you know there's up, giants, right? This is why I bring up uh, the, uh, the universe a little bit. Because you say it's really big, right? Like, infinitely big. Go ahead. Uh, my problem is the fact that, you know, people like yourself believe that God out of all the planets in all the universe chose our planet and chose you know to save not not you know not just one species but one segment of one species of everybody else that's right that's right well why would an all powerful well, first being, of all do you believe in a heliocentric or a geocentric earth helios it's madness madness no way i can watch the sun go across the sky every day yeah. is that madness no, 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 and that, and you, and it doesn't make madness because it makes total sense why we would originally believe we're heliocentric. I mean, uh, we want to feel, I think it's innately true that we just want to feel special, right? Like, as human born beings, we are special, especially to each other. But that kind of, like, ideal uh, has this, like, aligning with our, our, uh, our ideas that, you know, the universe is all around us. But, you know, we got to be more discerning that. But how can they that. prove that the, the, the Earth goes around us? Well, um, one way of proving it is uh, when you watch the patterns of the other planets in the sky, right? Uh, because in like olden times, uh, people were trying to figure out, like, all right, calculating mathematically, how uh, could you get like a, like you know some crystallized sphere so that the Earth is at the center? Was well, mathematics so I can prove anything to be true? No, not at all, man. Yes, yes at all. Well, it depends, right? If you have contradictions, you know, yeah, you can. With well, mathematics, they can prove the geocentric and heliocentric well, both. Yeah, but one is like radically easier to prove than the other one. And nature does so favor means... simplicity. Right? I mean like I if I if I let go of this glove, I can I can guess. Right, I'm not ask... sure if it'll drop, right? So let me ask you a question. It happens every time. If I'm sitting on top of a car, yeah. standing on top of a car driving yeah. at hundred miles an hour, or say at two thousand miles an hour, I'm gonna fly off the top of the car. Yeah, it was gonna stop, right? No, I'll just fly off regardless. Well it depends. How are you tied to the car? No, you, you're not gonna stay on there. Well, then, if it goes from like zero, so if, if, you, if you you have to stay perfectly still, yeah. not and not do anything to fall off. Are we staying perfectly still right now? We're moving around, driving around, flying right now. So the Earth is flying around at thousands of miles an hour with all this movement. People moving, jumping, playing basketball. We'd be flying up the goddamn Earth Obviously, in the outer space. It well, it's kind of relative, right? It's relative, because oh, it's relative. Yeah. So then, the, if everything is relative, then how could you have? Then that means that if, <laughs> if everything is relative, the Earth goes around the Sun and the Sun goes around the Earth. No, I mean like what I mean by relative is, um, you know, to us that car is moving because we're we're standing here and this distance. It is can, moving. Yeah, but I mean it's moving past us, right? Uh, but at the same time, us and the car being on the Earth are moving the same way that like. Oh, man, I don't know yeah, we be getting it. tossed off the planet. It's all it's all bullshit. Everything you've been tossed a lot. Really? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I like I can you can do experiments to show that it's in the true. Okay. Yeah, what's that? Yeah, okay, so, so you know how that's produced, right? Like, this is for yeah. the time camera. Yeah, yeah. It takes pictures over time, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. The time lapse. Why so, does it look like everything's going around the earth? So the reason why this happens is because uh, our Earth is on the tilted axis, and like a top, you know, when a top spins, it kind of like as it starts to fail, starts to wobble. That's the effect you're seeing here. So like, like maybe like right here is the North Star, and as uh, the Earth ro rotates, it also kind of wobbles a little bit, and that creates this spinning to happen. Because the Earth. Oh, uh, that's everything moving around in a circle. The circle of the, the circle of the heavens. Yeah, it's no. So what I'm saying is, because all right, so the Earth 
it rotates, right? But it also, it doesn't like rotate like perfectly still. It also has like a little bit of tilt. You guys ever learned that? That's yeah, yeah, that's, well, the see, that's the problem. That's the wisdom that's of the second world. Grade, bro. That's the wisdom of the world. Learned that in elementary yeah. school. Yeah. But yeah. Whatever, that's man. the wisdom of the world. That's the wisdom. I mean, <laughs> that's how so, old. That's the here's, old. Here's the thing, because if it's not wisdom of the world, let me tell you guys about my religion. I'm actually. We don't have a religion. Okay, cool. Well, I have a religion. Okay. I'm a uh, pasta farin. You guys familiar with that? Pasta farin. Pasta farin. Do you eat pasta? I do enjoy pasta. Pasta farin is the people that believe that the earth. It was created 6,000 years ago by a giant flying spaghetti monster. 6,000 years ago? 6,000 years ago by a giant flying spaghetti monster. Yeah, that's asinine, though. <laughs> well, oh, why is it asinine? Because that, that's just some trolling shit. No, no, no. How, why is it asinine? I believe that. Well, that's, you that's, 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 why not? First, first, prove me wrong. First of all, <laughs> first, first of all, he's that's, invisible. Not even, that's not even original. He's in, no, I heard it that's all. That's not even original. I know it's not original. Why, it's my yeah, religion. That, I got that, that from the, the teacher Bob. He brought that to the yeah, earth. Yeah, that's that old liberal bullshit they be teaching up in these colleges. Oh no, you don't learn that in college, man. Man, it's all You gotta seek the truth all the, to find them, that out. Them libtards always talking that shit, man. Libtards? Talking about the flying spaghetti monster. Like we ain't heard that before. Flying spaghetti monster. But here's the thing, right? <laughs> Tell me why he's not as real. Because it's fucking spaghetti don't fly. It's cherry. Well, fucking man in the UFO, sky with a beard doesn't exist either. No, he does doesn't? have a beard and he flies around in a UFO. <laughs> well, hold on, hold on. Then why can you believe that, but not a because flying you, spaghetti monster? Well, you can see with your own eyes. I there have been it. countless UFO sightings. I, have those are, those, I just told you the uh, Russian cos. Have you been in outer there space? Have, been countless have you or sites. have you not been in outer space? I have not. That no. Russian cosmonaut has. Yeah. And he's seen an angel, a giant celestial being. Okay. I, I have many. You, have, you haven't been in outer space. Well, I haven't, but neither have you, right? No, I haven't. I Actually, haven't. not recently. Well, so neither of us have, right? And so the people I'm talking to, they're saying they see the spaghetti monster as well. Well, it's nonsense, though. Then why is it nonsense? Because why is your thing real and my thing's not real? Nonsense means it makes no goddamn sense. Well, your thing makes no goddamn sense. It contradicts science, which can predict what a, a mass amount of things. What science the phones mean? we have in our pocket were created not by some guy saying, I think I'm going to throw some things together, but by people over time measuring outcomes. Measuring, measuring. Yeah. So where, 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 where's effect. the science of geometry come from? Geometry? I studied Who's Pythag Who Pythagoras? Pythagoras. Well, um, he started a school. He did believed. It, did, they, did they teach heliocentricity? Did they teach a heliocentric Earth or a geocentric Earth? I think Pythagoras time they believed in a heliocentric Earth. They, we, no, a lot of them taught geocentric. What about? Oh, sorry, geocentric, geocentric. You're right. Yeah, you're right. But see, the thing is, we gotta let our, our thoughts and opinions evolve over time. You can't get caught in no ways. Like for example. If I believe that there's a flying spaghetti monster, right? <laughs> and then you're able to convince me that there's so not. So it's square right? root of two. Square root of two? Yeah. It's, um, it's a, a number that repeats for an infinitely long amount of time. There's no such thing as a square root of two. Because two's not a square. So square root of two. So you believe, you believe in he, a heliocentric Earth. You believe in a square root of two. Yeah. You believe in a spaghetti monster. Yeah. Well, you, you believe in all these lies and all this bullshit. But I studied mathematics in college. But you said there was a square root of two. Well, so it depends on what you mean by is there a square root of two. Let me give you an example for mathematics, right? So here's kind of like a puzzle that I like to give my students a lot. Um, when is five plus eight equal to uh, one? No, I want you to prove me that there's a square root of two. Sure, sure, I will. I, will. I can do that, I can do that. But like, answer me this question How first. many sides does a square have? A square has four sides. No, it has two sides, right? A square? You mean like... It depends on the definition. So you gotta be straight about your definitions. So in mathematics, we're very careful about everything we define. Well, if there's a square root of two, that means a square only has two sides. Nope, square root of two it has two points. This is what square root of two means. That square root symbol is shorthand for what a very is, long. What, what, what is what is what does two squared mean? Two squared. So let me tell you what a square is. Four. The square root is the number that, when multiplied by itself, equals four. It so makes a square. a square. Hold on, hold on. The square root. The, the, the symbol square root means the number that which multiplied by this same number equals hey, oh yeah, less hey, oh square. Yeah, my square. So the square root of four. A it's, a, it's a geometrical expression. Yeah, and it's shorthand. The square root symbol is shorthand to something else. So how can you have a square root of two? That doesn't make no sense. It's tough. It's tough. It is, I, you know, I, need, I need like something to draw with to help you out. Like, cause I mean, it's not, it's me not innate, you know? Yeah, pen. Oh, uh, we ain't got no pen. 
I ain't finish it. If you say a square root of two, you tell me there's a square root of two. Yeah. There's a flying spaghetti monster, and the the Earth goes around the sun. Even though I can watch the sun go around, the chemtrails don't exist either. You know that? I don't. They're not spraying us with anything. They're not spraying us. Well, they might not be. But they they're not. Be. I don't see anything up there. What are you talking about? You got a piece of paper? I have. One. I'm gonna show you something. about the science thing. I'll go ahead and read it. All right, first, did Pythagoras believe in the square root of two? Pythagoras, uh, no, he killed a man for trying to talk about the square root of two. Right, because he deserved to be put to the death for that nonsense. What? <laughs> it's nonsense. Okay, go on, read your thing, man. What's he saying? First Timothy 6, verse 20. O Timothy, keep that which is committed to thy trust, avoiding profane and and vain babblings and oppositions of science falsely so far. So you, you coming out with that false science, talking about a helocentric earth, square roots of two, flying spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti monster. Yeah, That's what they science. teach you at the Pastafarian churches. Come here, watch this. Get this on camera. What is this? So it's just going to... Okay, we're gonna do uh, two squared. What's two squared? Two squared is four. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three, four. What is that? It makes a square. Okay. So if I do if I do the uh, four squared, what is yeah. that? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Right on. One, two. Uh, I'm fucking up. We, cool. we'll yeah, do no yeah, yeah, you got it. Okay. Nice. That, that makes a square. Yeah. So here's two. How do you get a square? Like, by the way, this is the square root of one. Yeah. Right it's, it's, I mean, the square root of uh, six. Yeah. Okay. If you add all these up, because four squared is what? 16. Yep. So the square root of 16 is 4. Yep. That's the root. It's right here. One, oh, two, three. Fuck. So if I only got 2, yeah. how can you get a square root of 2? Well, so this is why. You mind if I draw it in your book? All right, so the thing is. It, it's not a square. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a straight let line. Me show you, let me show you what the square root of 2 is. So if you got a line, all right, and we say like this is like a centimeter, like an inch, whatever, right? Now you, so that, 1. Right here, you got another line. No. Yeah, we're just saying it's like length 1. Does that make sense? One of whatever, meter, centimeter. Go ahead. All right, cool. The distance between these two, right there. That's Pythagorean theorem. That's going to be the square root of two. Yeah, but so the, in, all right. That's the Pythagorean yeah, yeah. theorem has nothing to do with the square root of two. Wait, yeah, it does. No, it doesn't. No, by definition. Because it's not a square. This is the triangle of a square. No, no, I'm just saying the length no. of that line. This is a line. Two makes a line. It does not make a square. You cannot, there's no such thing as a square root of two. Unless you use them floats. Well, well, so, in mathematics, right, um, What people, does the word math mean? I believe that mathematics is a form of art. What does the word math mean? It's not art. What does the yeah, word math is, mean? Man. Well, that's the problem, though. Our schools teach it like it's a science. What does the word it's math not. mean? Uh, I the get, word get math. John, uh, math is a subject. Uh, what is, math is a, math a is a study of simplistic, beautiful uh, ideas. John, uh, yeah, hey. What does the word math mean? Where does it come from? What is the word math? It's a Hebrew word. It's in the Bible. It comes from the Hebrew word amach, which is a variant of the Hebrew word amen. Amen means truthfully. So math means truth. Right okay. Oh, I see that. And everything you're speaking is a lie. Well, hold on, though, because just because you don't understand it doesn't mean it's automatically a lie though right because i don't understand you telling me well i'm saying you might i mean maybe you do understand it but i'm saying like maybe i'm just not making myself clear and that You're just not. Is, okay so that so that doesn't make what i'm saying a lie just because i was being unclear right so i'm just saying you know don't be like oh you're lying just because the communication so why, why, so why did the, the pythagoreans kill somebody so their belief was that the world could be represented in whole numbers Right? That God only worked in whole numbers. That he worked in like one, two, three, four, five. No, they, and no, that he worked with like, you know, fractions too, like one over two, what, three over four, stuff like that. The problem with the square root of two yeah, that's is that it's an irrational number. Irrational number. Irra what does irrational mean? Non-rational. You're, you're irrational. When you, when you tell me 
did the yeah. did the Earth goes around the sun when I can watch the sun go around the Earth every day, every day. I guarantee you, try this. Go outside in the morning, watch the sun. I, I bet your ass it's going to go it's across come the up sky. In the east. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Every day, like clockwork. Now here's the deal. Like so, the sun comes up and it goes up lower in the winter time, but in the summertime it goes up higher. Why is the sun doing that? Do you guys know? Because the what does that have to do with anything? Well, you got to question things, right? So you got to ask questions and you got to be prepared to receive real answers, right? Because if the sun's going around the Earth, why is it changing the way it goes around the Earth? Science has a really good explanation for that. Right, right. right? And you can prove it. You read this, sir. Verse 32. Yeah. And you shall know the truth, and the truth shall set you free. You shall make you free. So what is the truth? The, the Bible is the truth. Okay, the words of the prophets is the truth. Okay. You guys ever read any historical Bible works? By men that have studied like the yeah, where the Bible yeah, come from? The like Apostle that? Paul? Yeah. Yeah, he was a scholar. Yeah. Did you know that? He was a scholar. But I'm talking about like modern day biblical scholars. You guys Almost, ever... Most of them are homosexuals, devil worshippers, who worship Marduk. I think and they're Seeker. Christians though, aren't they? Yeah, they worship Marduk right, right. and Osiris and Secret. They're Freemasons. Well, what men of the world was going around calling themselves Christians? Well, so here's my question too: Is like, so which religion is correct of all the religions? Like, which is the one right? Religion? None of them. Yeah, none, none of them. None of them are correct. 14, well, that, I believe that more than anything because it's really 14, hard to say like, six. you know, all oh, my religion is more correct. Right, 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 right. None of them. Are. But here's the deal too: You guys are coming at me right with an idea of how the. You told me there's a square root of two, bro. Right. Yeah, dude, for sure there is. No, you know there's not. Oh, dude, I you know just don't there want is. Me I studied mathematics in you college. Know I can write out clear and concise logical proof of the fact that there is indeed a square root of two. <laughs> now what, what is it? I can write it out. I know, know you can't, can. no, you can't. Can. A supercomputer can't write it out. Right. Yeah, sure can. Because it don't right. exist. Right, and actually they're trying to figure it out. The square root of two can. just goes on forever and it doesn't exist, That's right. bro. That's right. That's right. Okay, so what's the square root of four? Read the scripture. Let me read this real quick. Let me read this real quick. This is this is this is Daniel one and four. Children of whom was no blemish, but well favored and skillful in all knowledge, in all wisdom, and cunning in knowledge and understanding science. Yeah, and what does science mean? It's Latin. It means knowledge. Uh -huh. So this. Well, so you're talking knowledge. about like what it means. You're talking about the root of the word. No, the root. The of etymology. The etymology. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, it's two different things, right? Because you gotta have a foundation. Yeah. If you don't have a solid foundation, your house, if your house is not built upon a rock, yeah. and if your house is built up on the uh, on the seashore, you your, see your house is built on sand, right on the ocean. And when that high tide comes in, your raggedy ass house is getting washed, washed away right out to the ocean. Yeah. Another thing you gotta be careful though is that when building your house, you gotta make sure everything that's keeping it together. Mm -hmm. Is is solid too, you know. You can't just build a house it's like the three little on a good pigs. foundation. Like yeah. I actually have no problem. I'm you like the right three now. little pigs that built this house out of straw. Yeah, I'm gonna tell you right now. I have no problem with you guys saying like I believe in God, you know, I believe in Jesus, stuff like that. There's nothing wrong with like believing in those things, okay? But what I do have a problem is then like going from that. So, so like, you believe in evolution too, then? Yeah, of course. So you believe in anything <laughs> made lime? Mainstream no. go government issued uh, oh, no. knowledge is what you're talking believe. about. I can tell you, I can go on all day. I'm a radical socialist. I believe. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no, I got, I got problems with. I got qualms with the government all day, and I got qualms with how our society is run and how the you know, common people always like care about everyone dressing and stuff like that. I mean, I'll tell you right now. Listen, this is why science is important. Okay, this is why I believe. What is science though? With the etymology of the word. Science is knowledge. Yeah, no, okay. I, knowledge is important. Yeah, knowledge is super important. I believe important. in knowledge. Right now, so we agree then. We agree. This is knowledge now, and science believe, are important. I right? believe in truth knowledge, not bullshit. Well, we got to be careful, though. How, you, do you, you, got, how do you distinguish? You got knowledge of lies and knowledge of truth. Right. You got knowledge of lies. Right, so cars, though, right. When, when, you, when, you, when you say you believe in a flying spaghetti monster, <laughs> that, that's madness. Well, how's that, that, that's irrational. You know and that's that. irrational. I like this. And that's unreasonable. <laughs> Why is it unreasonable? Because it's very unreasonable. Well, just it's just because you don't believe it, it's not making it unreasonable, right? You gotta like a diner to say something like that, believe it, man. 
You gotta let But he don't believe it. That's the kind of way of trolling me. No, 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 I believe it. I if you can you tell me why it's done, you this. I'll tell you. I told you why. You said you believe in science. Well, a man is not flying in the sky. If you believe in science, when have you seen spaghetti get up and start flying? Since you believe in science. Uh-huh. Well, all right. I'm not talking about, like, the normal spaghetti in the place. We're talking about, like, uh, you know, ethereal spaghetti, right? We're not talking about just oh, normal spaghetti. Oh, theoretic now. Not theoretic, <laughs> ethereal. Like, kind of like oh, oh ethereal. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's in the ether. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So here's the deal. Let me saying, ask you a question. Yeah. Who's the greatest... We want to fly. Who's the most magnificent... Well, what's, how do I put this? Do you know who Nikola Tesla is? I love Nikola Tesla. You know, Nikola Tesla, where did he say he got all of his knowledge from? Well, well as you he was... in the science so much, where did he get his knowledge? Well, as he was dying, he said a divine inspiration. Oh, divine inspiration! Yes, sir. He said he got all of his knowledge through dreams and visions. Yeah. Was revealed to him. Yep. How do you explain that shit? I believe the mind is a fantastic... Oh, machine. the mind. Yeah. yeah. Sure. No, bro, it was revealed to him by the Most High. Come on, you can't deny that. Hey, get that in the visions of the dream. Wait, you guys read about Joe the 33. little boy that died and went to heaven and came back? No, no? I heard about it. You heard about that, right? Yeah, I heard so he about said it. he knew where he wrote a whole video. book. He was really famous in the media. Man, for a you heard time. that a thousand times. Well, and that's what I'm saying. Is a lot of people will tell you it's a about con game. And that's what I'm saying. How you N know Nick Nikola Tesla wasn't no con man. No, he wasn't. He was an honest, amazing man. But here's the deal: it's people. I don't know, I don't no, know he was. He was raised Orthodox. Orthodox. That's right. In, uh, His mom, Annie, hated right. Annie hated Jews. Annie hated Jews. Did. Which Aren't is you, Israel, it's not about Jews. It's where the real Jews. Jews. Okay. Those Jews over there are a bunch of devils. Okay. They're not Jews. They're, oh. you, you heard of people being uh, uh, identity thieves. I, they're identity, like Ibra Einstein. Exactly. You, you know what Tesla said about Ibra Einstein? No. He's a fucking idiot. Really? Yeah. He's a fucking He was idiot. a pretty smart guy though, wasn't he? No, smart. No, he no, he's no. a Jew devil. He he worked at a patent office uh, stealing people's stealing money. everybody's uh work. Yeah. He didn't know anything. He couldn't even do basic mathematics. Yeah, he could. Well, he could. He was, he was retarded. He was a retarded. He was a fucking Jew. He's a devil. Well just because you're a Jew makes you retarded? Well it makes you a devil. Yeah. Some some of them are kind of smart. Yeah. But the devil, they worship Satan. Hey, give, uh, you that story, yeah, Joe, 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 yeah. Joe, yeah. Oh, gross, man. <laughs> you gonna have to throw the whole goddamn country away. <laughs> this is Joe 32, 33, and 14. Now and listen, the most high speaketh once. This is a Tesla scripture. Yea, twice. Yet man perceiveth it not. So you don't perceive it. What? Your, your perception lacks. How so? Watch. In a dream, in a vision of the night, when deep sleep falleth upon men and slumberings upon the bed, then he openeth the ears of men and sealeth their instruction. Right, so when Tesla was dreaming, he's getting most high silk that that now is in that wisdom and the spirit. It was given to him. So, so let me ask you, have you yeah, ever right. had a dream? Where somebody in your dream taught you something that was true, then you woke up the next day and Googled it and found out that what you was told in your dream was true. This happened to me uh, quite a few times. So here's the thing, guys. How did that happen? Like, how does God communicate to us through our dreams? Well, you know, it's, it's hard to explain something spiritual. It's spiritual. You got to be a spiritual thing. Yeah. I mean, just yeah. the angels. They're around us right now, but you can't sense it. But, uh, you even even uh, you go back to so you, a mathematician. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pythagoras believed in the spirit. He said that the spirit was infinite, and, and all men died and always came back in the reincarnation. Yeah, but Pythagoras was also afraid of bees. You know, he was definitely afraid of bees. He died because he I'm was not being teaching. The, I'm just teaching something you know. I'll give you an example. So you're familiar with Pythagoras. So I use that as an example. Yeah, but he, he believed in the spirit. Then he had yeah, a but, he, or heart but he believed in a lot of stupid shit. You then know? he have a stroke or heart attack. Well, he did. He wasn't a man. I'm not saying we ain't following that shit. We're following the Bible. Yeah, I'm using that as an example. Well, I mean, this don't is a man who's not a good example. But no, without him, you wouldn't even have your Pythagorean theorem. He's a brilliant man. <laughs> Actually, he didn't come from him, right? Remember, because he killed the guy who tried to reveal it. <laughs> Well, whatever, man. You know what I'm saying. And it did I know what you're trying to say. I know what you're trying to say. But here's the deal, right? You gotta be really discerning. You gotta say. Right? You gotta question, right? So here's the question I always have. I always ask myself, 
Where did the universe come from? Now, one good answer is God, right? But if you're brave, you will then ask, where did God come from? Oh. If you say he's always existed, then why not say, save yourself a step and say the universe has always existed? Or if you say, I do not the know most high, The most high is the universe. Yeah. The most high is the spirit. Wait, so where did, the, where did God come from? What do you mean? He, he's the most high. He, 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 what does God's name mean in Hebrew? Wait, 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 wait. No, no, this is very important because this explains everything. Okay. What is the Most High's name in Hebrew? I forget. I, I heard one. In the Bible, the English says Jehovah. Jehovah, yes. Yeah. But it's Yahweh. Yahweh, yeah, yeah, I heard that before, yeah. You look it up. Aren't you like not supposed to say that? <laughs> You're supposed to proclaim the he, name he, upon he, the he, mountainside. Heathens okay. can't say it. You're supposed oh, okay. to. Then you're Jews. supposed to proudly. Own, see, the so-called Jews in Israel, they call him Hashem. Okay. It means the name. That's because they can't say his. Because they worship Satan. And they're not going to tell everybody yeah, that no, great on. name. Wait, You're wait, supposed we got to. Though. So where did the universe come from? I'm about to tell you. No, oh, what, yeah. what does God's name mean? It consists of two words, Yah. No, say, it, no, Yah. But it, no, they say Yahweh. That's not how you say oh, it. Say it's that? Yah. Okay. It's Yah Hawa. Okay. The, the first part of the name is Yah. In Hebrew, that means he. Yeah. If I put Yah at the beginning of any word, it means he. Yeah. Okay? And then Hawa means to be or to exist. Yeah. So the God's name himself means he to be, he that is, the all-existing one. Okay, okay. He is goes. everything. Oh, okay. okay. That's what you're right. Well, I'm about to read it. That's what okay. okay. he got it. Okay. I'm about to read it. This is Genesis chapter 1, yeah. verse 1. Yeah. In the beginning, God created the heaven and the earth. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that. Yeah. <laughs> now, all right, hold on, though. So then where did God come from? I mean, that's a... I just told you what his name you know, means. You he's, know, he's always existed. But why not just say the universe has always existed? I just told you the most, high, always the most high is the universe. Right. He, we, uh, he is everything. He is in us. The most high The most high spirit is in that tree. The trees have a spirit. I see what you're saying. Now, the, the, the spirit, his spirit is in the air. But that means that the most is the high earth. is also in the juice? No. Oh, no, wait, no, actually, it's in everything, though, isn't it? No, his righteous spirit is not. But the Most High created good and evil. Also, yeah, here's a question too, right? So God, why? You know, He's an omnipotent, all-powerful being, right? Obviously. Obviously. Why did He, why is the only way that He could forgive humans for the sin that He gave them in the first place is to send His own Son and have Him then brutally murdered by the people that He can control? Pay for his sin. Pay for his sin. But, no, but, but, is that really like the, the most creative, best way God could have done it? Hey, I mean, yeah, pick it up with him. all powerful, all omnipotent. That's right. Right, yeah. That's right. And uh, He decided to give us a sin. And then decided to forgive us, and then but the way to do that is he had to kill himself. Yeah, Acts the first chapter. No, 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 no. His son, right? No. Wait, wait, hold on. Yeah, that's the deal, right? He sent his son, and then he had that to have us son. kill him. Huh? Well, let me ask you a question. But isn't that just kind of silly? He didn't have I mean, us kill him. Can't you just, huh? You agree with me? Yeah? No, I say you said he had us kill him. We didn't kill him. But not us. Yeah. But like, you know, the people when, back when then, right? Us. Oh, yeah. You ask me how silly this is. Go back to UFOs. But, uh, because, like, God, uh, let me give you an alternate example. Did Jesus what live? If, is he a real person? He might have been. I mean, I wasn't around. I didn't see him. I don't know him. But well, you was around. I'm saying, okay, did, did uh, Julius Caesar live? I began, I don't know. I mean, probably. Right? Say, with Jesus. Come on, bro. Let's be real with it. Then there are many accounts. According, according to yeah, historical yeah. accounts, did Julius Caesar live? Yes. Okay, then, according to historical accounts, did Jesus live? Yes. Some people say yes. Yeah. No, many. There's more. Many, many. There's not more, everyone. Many. There's people more say proof yes. that he lived than any other person ever. You don't know about that, but there's a lot of proof he lived. Yeah, there's some proof he lived. There's some proof, my ass. Okay. Is is endless. I'm agreeing with you. I'm agreeing. With you. Go on. Oh. All right. So ha what happened when he died? Well, what? He was supposedly crucified. But when and there was many witnesses. That's why. That's the thing about the Bible. Yeah. Oh yeah. Here's another thing too, right? And then he rose from the dead, right? Right. So, but hold up. Okay. Go ahead. There's a law in the Bible that says, out of the mouth of two or three witnesses, yeah. let everything be established. Yeah. So according to the Bible, unless you have at least two witnesses or three, what you're saying is not true. Now hold on. Though. What about the the Mormons? Well, hold on a second. What the hell? Because they have a lot of witnesses they're, saying they're, that Jesus. What do you mean? They're they're faggots. Functions. They're faggots. But how do you know? <laughs> they have a lot of witnesses. Come on, bro. That's Joseph them. Smith and Mormons, and you don't bro. Come on. Wisdom, whatever Mormons. They have, they yeah. The Mormons. Bison. Yeah. Mormons. That's all I gotta say. More fucking Mormons. Yeah, morons. Mor yeah. But how do you know? Because they are saying they've seen Jesus. They're saying they've talked to God. 
Why haven't they? Come on, they're fucking more dude. Wait, they're, they're the biggest douchebags on the planet Earth. You ever talk to some Mormons? Yeah, they're no. all fucking douchebags. Why do you say it? How, do you, how can you say they're wrong? Just because they're douchebags? Yes, that's a lot of proof I need. <laughs> Let's get back to this. Now, here's the deal. Do you actually need more proof than that? You can laugh it off. And actually, a lot of people to bear witness, yeah. that lied, because there's a such thing as a false witness, but they lied about what they seen. They oh, we seen the gold plates. But what a about lot of people I'm, lying about Jesus? But listen, a lot, you know a lot of people that seen those plates uh -huh. left the church and they said it was all bullshit. Mm -hmm. A lot of people still there. Too. Yeah, they got the name. I forget the name. Yeah, I think the Mormons are still the fastest growing in uh, Christianity now, aren't they? Well, it is. Uh, it's a bastardized form of Christianity. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. What I'm saying is, it's like you know, it's a it's a growing sect. But but there was people who claimed that they, they seen those plates, but they. They left the church and they said it was all a fraud. Yeah, but a lot of Christians become atheists too, right? Does that make Christianity yeah. wrong? Just hold it. Let's go back to my point. Let me but finish no, no, my point. <laughs> yeah, now, now why, why okay. is there Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John? That's what I'm saying. Well, how come there's not just one book like the Quran? Okay. Because that's multiple witnesses. Yeah, yeah. And that's why each one of them might be a little different. Because one person's perspective might have been a little different from the next. Yeah, there's proof that this is all true, yet yeah, more witnesses. And everybody's seen this happen. When the Lord was crucified, there was earthquakes. Yeah. The sky turned black. The people rose about their graves and zombies were walking around. But here's the deal, too. Uh, the Bible wasn't written until 200 years after the death of Jesus, right? Oh, because no, that's not that's true. When, no, that's when the Catholic Church was founded, right? Because the Catholic Church, Catholic was, Church was founded by... I'm talking about Constantine in the year 3 something? Well, the Catholic, no, the Catholic Church was founded by Peter, right? But then, but he was because he was the first vicar of Christ, right? You guys said in your history, right? <laughs> and then, but the but the word of the Bible did not form into a real church because according that, to who? Christians were getting crossed. You know, the, according to the scholars in these schools, would tell you that the oldest book in the New Testament is First Thessalonians, which was written in 52 A.D. Yes. Yeah. Well. Yes. Yeah. It's been a while. Go <laughs> ask your fucking faggot theologians. They'll tell you. I'm talking. They're all homosexuals. But is homosexuality wrong too? <laughs> oh, don't tell me you're gay, man. I'm not gay. But hey, what's wrong with that? I'm not. What? Hey, what's going on? You ain't gay. Do I look good? You tried it before, though, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> where, haven't you from? where are you from? Where are you from? Yeah, I have. Or are you a Slavic or something? No, I'm from Slavic. No, what, your ancestors? Well, my ancestors, uh... Your dad's side, your dad's side. I think we got some Terminal. family in Czechoslovakia. I was just trying to call it. He's like, I, I know spirits. He's probably over there.